To install Adobe Captivate, we're going to start out by using the magnifying glass in the top right corner. That takes us to the spotlight. We'll type in self-service here and then click on it or possibly double click if it doesn't come up. Once it does, on the right hand side you need to cho choose Adobe Creative Cloud and then from there we're going to click on install under Adobe Captivate. You should, should see it start to progress across the top and then Captivate should be installed. Um, we'll go back to the magnifying glass in the top right, type in Captivate this time, and you'll select Adobe Captivate located right here. It will pop up with a message that says to open Adobe Captivate you need to install the legacy Java SE 6 runtime. Go ahead and click the More Info button. Brings us up with a page here where we can download that. Click the word Download. And then what should happen is down in the bottom corner, you'll get a little message here that tells you um, that it could harm your computer. Do you want to discard or keep it? We want to choose to keep it. And then after it finishes, you'll see the uh, program name listed down here. Use the little drop down next to it and choose open. And then you should see it come up and uh, begin to progress. You get a little folder with a uh, .pkg extension. Go ahead and click or double click it if necessary. Then it tells you that you'll be guided through here. You're going to continue. You'll get some important information. Again, click continue. And then a license agreement. Go ahead and continue again. It'll ask you then if you're willing to accept it, click the Agree. We're going to uh, click Install, just leaving the location where it's at. You have to type in your username and password and then click Install Software. Then it will uh, show the progress. And when it's complete, you'll get the installation was successful. Click close at that time. Then go back up to the magnifying glass in the top right. Search for Captivate again. When it comes up, uh, click on the Adobe Captivate. And it should pop up with a little menu like this. If everything looks like that, then you've got it properly installed.